Let's see, we got a few more here. Christy? Thanks, Skip. Willie Moss? Right here, Skip. Yeah, must be from a writing cousin. Admiral Gruber? I can dream, can I? <laughs> Boy. And Virgil. Hmm, not bad. <laughs> well, that's about it, boys. Well, I'll be seeing you guys. I gotta go home. Well, what's the matter, Chuck? Uh, it says here I gotta report for jury duty. <laughs> hey, my kid can say daddy. Your oh. kid? You mean our kid. We're the godfather. And don't you forget it. Yeah, don't you forget that. Oh, just look at that doll. Little Christina, Charlene, Leslie, Wilhelmina, Tinka, Virginia, Penny, and Quintilla. Uh, Fuziana? Oh, yeah, Fuziana. <laughs> Hey, wait till you hear the best part. I'm going to be able to hear her say, Daddy. What are you talking about? What, what do you mean, hear her? Yeah, really. Our next-door neighbor, Mr. Potter, has got a ham radio set, and he's going to try and broadcast to us at 5 o'clock, Teratupa time on the 23rd. Hey, how about it? 23rd? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Hey, wait, that's tonight. Hey, hey how about that? Do you think Bingham's going to let us use a base radio tonight? Well, I think once he, we tell him about it, why, of course he will. <laughs> After all, he's still a human being. <laughs> yeah, I saw him pet a dog once. <laughs> how about that? In a few hours, I'm going to be able to hear my kid. Our kid! <laughs> to that your eyes. I know what I got the eyes. Stop looking over my shoulder. Just nobody minute. likes a smart lieutenant. <laughs> Hi, Captain. Hi, puppy. <laughs> Mikhail. What's the trouble this time? Well, no, 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 no trouble, sir. No, sir. We're here to make a very special request, sir. And because we know that you're the understanding kind of officer that thinks first, last, and always of the good of his men. Uh oh, it's worse than I thought. What'd you do? Torpedo my gig? Oh, no, sir. You torpedoed the Admiral's gig. Oh, come on now, Captain. You're kidding. <laughs> I knew it. They got one of our aircraft carriers. <gasps> oh, no, sir. You're wrong. Uh, guess again. It's smaller than a bread box. Now, now, there's nothing wrong at all, Captain. You see, we're here to ask your permission to use the base radio tonight. You see, Quartermaster Christopher... Use the base radio? Do I look like a complete moron to you? Oh, no, sir. Nobody's perfect. What? I, well, no, no, I'm sure that if you just listen, sir, I, I'm sure that... Uh, that tale. I don't know what racket you and your seagoing mafia are mixed up in this time, but whatever it is, this is my answer. Carpenter? Yes, sir. You will draw one Thompson submachine gun and 10,000 rounds of ammunition. You will then station yourself outside of the radio shack, and if Commander McHale or any of his merry men so much as cast a shadow in your direction, you will shoot to kill. Aye, aye, sir. But, Captain, if you heard what we really want, I I'm sure you'd give us a break. Break? You want a break, Mikhail? Oh, I'll give you a break, all right. Uh, don't shoot the kill. Shoot them in the foot. <laughs> out, out, out. Now, maybe you'd understand if you had a baby of your own. If I had a bit Him between the eyes. Right between the eyes. Bye-bye, Captain. I'm not going to hear. I'm not going to hear my little baby say, Daddy. Come on, take it easy, kid. Oh, you're full of crummy deals. And we said Binghamton was human. We're going to yeah. take this lying down, Skip? No, you can bet your royal skibbies we're not going to take it laying down. Now, I know that Pete, the radio man, will go along with us. But we got to figure out some way of getting Carpenter away from that radio shack. I know, Skip, but how are we going to do it? Hey, wait a minute, wait a minute, guys. I got an idea. What if we can get that new blonde nurse at the base to take Carpy out for a little moonlight stroll? Nah, he's too G.I. Uh, that chicken Charlie wouldn't leave his post for a dame. Yeah, but wait a minute. What if the dame uh, turned out to be a damsel in distress? Hmm? Mm hmm? A damsel in distress. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, 
hurried up, you guys. It's ten minutes of five. How does he look? Fine. Right. You look great. Come on. Divert you all set? Yes. Right. Here we go. Here we go. Stay down. Stay down. Now. Now. Oh, you, oh, how dare you, you beast! Put me down this instant! Oh, you're just... You put me down! Hook! Sailor! Put that nurse down! Now that's an order! Help! Save me! Somebody save me! Oh, you please! An officer on duty never leaves his post. Help! Save me! Help! I may be an officer, but I'm still a gentleman. <laughs> For you. I'm going out for a smoke. Good, good. Look, I don't know from not going. Go on, baby. It's five on the button. Hurry up. This is W9643, San Diego, calling CO Taratupa. This is Victory Easy 397 Taratupa to W9643. We're reading you and standing by. Hello, Taratupa. I've got a Mrs. Christopher and a little Miss Christopher waiting to talk to Daddy. Hello, dear. Hello. How are you, darling? Are you well? Oh, hi, honey. Yeah, I'm, I'm fine. I hope you're well, too. But listen, we haven't got much time. Could you put the baby right on? Of course, darling. That was your daddy, dear. Say, daddy. Talk to daddy, honey. Sweetheart, talk to daddy. Yeah, honey, daddy's waiting. Say it. Daddy. <laughs> D-A-D-D-Y. Come on, darling. Talk to Daddy. Come on, honey. Say Daddy. Come on, honey. Daddy. Dada. Come on, honey. Please, darling. Your, your Daddy's waiting. Say Daddy. Daddy? Daddy. Please, honey, please. Papa. Come on, say daddy. Talk to daddy. Daddy, come on, honey. Come on. Daddy. <laughs> can't you get through? No, that's the nips for sure, jamming the whole dial. I can't get nothing. But I gotta hear my kid. <laughs> we'll keep working on it, will you? And hurry, Copper will be coming back. Why are you to stop? Stop, you fiend! Stop, you fiend! Stop! Oh. Oh. Sir, I'm sorry. Are you all right, sir? Never mind me. I don't know what that sailor sees in that woman, but go after him. Yes, sir. I'm Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Why aren't you at your post? Oh, sir, that poor little nurse. You should have seen that oh, sailor. She was screaming. Just watch your language. I... That poor little nurse. <gasps> I thought that poor little nurse looked like she needed a shave. <laughs> Look out, sir! Hello, honey, this is your daddy. Say, daddy, come on! Right now, settle for a goo goo. Yeah, you have me a loaded gun. Follow me. Come on, boys, we gotta show off. Come on, let's go. But I gotta hear my kid. Come on, let's go. Come on, let's go. We better split up and meet over at the... At the break, is that the word you're looking for? Call in! Oh. I said in, not out! Oh, oh. <laughs> All right, Nurse Bell, you and your boyfriend, go, go! <laughs> Trespassing on government property, operating a military radio illegally, disobeying the commanding officer's orders, luring an officer of the guard from his post, and finally, impersonating a nurse in a combat zone. This is going to be a fun court martial. <laughs> sir, you can't take it out on the whole crew. They did it just to help me, sir. Is that what they did? Get yes, back sir. in line. 
Ah, uh, well now, Captain, as Commander of the 73, sir, I insist on taking full blame and responsibility. Blame and responsibility, Mikhail? How about guilt? We don't like to break up a set, you know. <laughs> now then. Oh, sir, the phone is ringing. I know the phone is ringing. I've got ears, you nitwit. I'm not taking any calls. <laughs> sir, it's the scramble phone from Comfleet. Kill Joy. <laughs> Binghamton here. I... Oh, yeah, yes, yes, Admiral. Yes, the, uh, the jamming has been getting worse, Admiral. Yes. Oh. Well, we here at Terra Tupa just uh, we think it's a distinct pleasure and, and a privilege, Admiral, that you would select us to knock out the nip jamming station. We, uh, yes. Yeah. And, and may I say, Admiral... Oh, I, I may not. <laughs> yes, sir, thank you. All crews... Well, I, I, I know it's important, Admiral, to send out all available boats, but you see, sir, I've just got the 73 crew up on the... Yeah. <clears throat> Thank you, sir. I, I... <laughs> Carpenter, you will order all PT boats out to locate and destroy the enemy jamming station immediately. Aye, aye, sir. Uh, Captain, you said all boats. Uh, I presume that means the 73 boat, too? It's the 73, the 73. <laughs> You're still facing court-martial in the brig when you get back, and don't you forget it. Oh, yes, we won't forget about it. I'm going to tie a string around my finger. <laughs> <laughs> Christy, watch out! You almost hit that floating log, boy. I'm sorry, Skip. I guess my mind's about 6,000 miles away. I know, boy. Look, why don't you take a break? Chuck, take over for him, will you? Uh, don't let it get you down. Hey, Skip, I'm getting something. Those nips are back on the air again. Oh, Very yeah? 273 degrees. Yeah, 273. Then that's where they're at. They're on that island. Boys, prepare to make a landing. Chuck, take her in easy. Still no sign of them. Doggone it. All right, boys, take five. Boy, wait till I get my hands on that nip transmitter. Can you imagine that? Keeping Christie's daughter from saying dad at her daddy. I'm telling you I'm so mad. I can... oh, put that grenade away with you, Chuck. Yeah, well, it... uh, uh, Skip, I lost something. What? Uh, the pin. <laughs> yeah, you know, it goes in here. I know where it goes. Throw it. It's a live one. Is that an order? Skip? That's an order. Throw it. You're wasting government property, though. Troy! Oh, this is <laughs> Chuck, you found the nips. Come on, boys, let's go. Hey, the nips took off. Hey, let's go get him, Skip. Hold it, hold it, boys, hold it. Ah, it's too late. Let him go. We got what we came for anyway. Hey, this. Hey. How about that? <laughs> Ensign Parker just took himself an island. <laughs> now I'm gonna get me a nip jamming station. Okay, everybody back. All right, hold it, hold it, Chuck. Hold it, hold it, will you, Chuck? Hold it, stop it with those grenades, huh? Well, we got orders to blow it up, and after all, what they did to Christie. I know, I know, but... Say, now. I just got a hot flash here. Willie, we could reach stateside with a shortwave set this powerful, couldn't we? Uh, easy with a couple of changes. Well, uh, what if, say, um, at five o'clock tonight, our Senor Christie hears his little girl say, Daddy, courtesy of the nips. Hey, could I skip? Nah, Binghamton will never give us permission. Yeah. Well, who says we're going to ask for it? Come on, let's go. <laughs> Come on, let's go. <laughs> hey, Chuck, what are you looking for now? Oh, I lost a pin. Again? Yeah, here, let me have that. Wait a minute, Skip. Get over here, Chuck. I'm trying to tell you, not that pin. No button. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Hey, somebody's coming. Well, how'd it go, Skip? Fine, fine. Are the boat stash? Yeah, yeah, as far as anybody else knows, we're not back yet. Hurry it up, Willie. It's 28 minutes of five. I'm trying, but I still have to figure out how to make it quit sending that jamming signal. What's so tough about that? Every cotton pick and parts labeled in Japanese. Now, don't let that get you down, boy. Fuji and I will translate as we go along. All right, what do we got here now? Let's see here. Um... Shuhasu Hashinki. That's the... RF uh, output. RF output. Hmm, that could be it. Right, now, give her a... 
Turn it off. There's that blasted jammer signal again. Here, let's try this one. Zofuku Kaido. Zofuku. Nah. Um. Hashinka? Hashinka. Try the Hashinka. What? Oh, the oscillator. Oscillator. <laughs> I won't rest till I find out why Mikhail and his men were so anxious to break into that radio shack. Oh, neither will I, sir. It was absolutely disgraceful resorting to such trickery against a fellow officer in the United States oh, Navy, shut sir. Up. <laughs> sir, the scramble phone is ringing. No, the scramble phone is ringing. The scramble phone is ringing. That's all your good boys reporting bells. <laughs> Bang up to the air. <laughs> Hello, Admiral. Yes, sir. Oh, you located the enemy jamming station? Well, that's wonderful, Admiral. My area? Well, there, there must be some mistake, Admiral. I've... Yes, sir. 323 degrees by 57 degrees. Yes, sir. Thank you, Admiral. Turn on in the uh, radio. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. 23 degrees by uh, 57. This is the most ridiculous thing I've ever... Mikhail's Island. They stopped jamming, sir. Shut up. They, they said something about Mikhail. Sofuku Kaido, the power redistributors. That was it, Fuji. Banzai! Banzai! You hear that? Banzai. It's Mickey Ellie's talking to somebody named Fuji. Well, man, it looks like we're in business. Business. That's what they're doing. They sold out to the nips. The carpenter write everything down. Yes, sir. Oh, this is beautiful. Oh, this is beautiful. Not what I say, what they say, you nip is. I'm sorry, sir. Hey, Skip, I think your voice has been going out on the air. This switch was on. Oh, what a shame, sir. Never mind, I've got them. I've got them. Mikhail and his men are traitors. They're the Marines. Yes, sir. They're the firing squad. Firing squad. They may even let me pass out the cigarettes in the blindfold. Oh, sir. <laughs> wow, well, you got them. They're coming in. Woo! Hey, 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 hey. Knock it off. Knock it off. This is W9643 San Diego calling VE397 Taratupa. This is Victor Easy, 397 Taratupa to W9643. We're reading you loud and clear. Here's Christy. <clears throat> uh, hi, honey. Gee, I'm awful sorry we got cut off last night, but boy, I'm sure glad you tried again tonight. Before anything else happens, darling, you've just got to hear the baby. Say, Daddy. It's Daddy, honey. Look. It's Daddy. Say, Daddy. Oh, come on, darling. Say, hi, Dada. Dada. <laughs> Talk to Daddy. Come on, honey. Yeah, one little daddy for Uncle Quentin. Get you, get you. That always used to get me. <laughs> Good da, 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 Say, Daddy, please say, Daddy. Shh. I didn't say anything, sir. Shh. Oh, I wait. Condition red. Let bottom come. I go. Oh, time for him to show up. Well, if he finds out we didn't turn that radio and we're dead. Now, Christy, you'll never talk to us, kid. Come on, please, honey, just one little daddy. Hey, come on, Christy, hurry up, sign off. We gotta dump this radio. Come on, baby, just one. Say, Daddy, please, baby. <laughs> Come on, boys. We'll see if we can head off the empty. Get somebody to get that curtain. Hurry up. Come on, let's go. Daddy. Come on. Come on. Daddy. No, no, not that way. This way. Come on, let's go. Come on. 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 Come Hi, Captain. Hi. Now, wait a minute. Where are you going? Now, 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 Captain, here, Celia, we were just returned from our mission, and, uh, well, now, if you just step outside, sir, I'll, I'll make my report to you. Yes, sir. Get your hands off of me, you Benedict know. Arnold, you. Uh, All right, where's the radio? Uh, where's the radio? Where's the nips? The, the, the nips, sir? Yes, the nips, 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 nips. I heard you on the radio talking to a nip. 
How about uh, or will those are we see, sir? Uh... Oh, that was me, sir. I was just practicing my ventriloquism. Wanna hear me? Watch this. Hi, Captain. Oh, so hurry, hurry to know you. <laughs> <laughs> Knock it off, ventriloquism. What are you trying to hand me now? Come on, please, honey. Say daddy just once. Daddy. What was that? Oh, well, that was me. <laughs> it was not. It came from over there. Well, how about that? How my voice? Oh, but you probably don't believe me just because I lost my dummy. If I had my... Well, watch. Well, say hello, Captain. How are you? Hi, hi. Under your search. Hey, we're in Get it off of me, you maniac. Dada. Oogie boogie. Dada. Dada. See? Hold you again. Wasn't it terrific, sir? My lips didn't even move. <laughs> oh, shut up. I'll give you a fat lip. That's what I'll give you. What's behind that curtain? Oh, no, no, no. Get out of my way. Come back, Captain. You men cover me. I'm going in. Come back, Captain. That's oh, ah. da, da, oogie boogie, huh? I caught you red-handed talking to the enemy. Carpenter, put that down. It must be a code. Yes, sir. Uh, da, da. Goo, goo. Was that oogie boogie, oogie sir? Boogie. Now, yeah. if you'll just let me explain. Let me explain the court, Marshal McHale. I've got you this time. Sure. This is the nip radio. I know it, I know it. Market exhibit B. Exhibit B. Oh, Captain, all right. Okay, we, we captured the jamming station and we, we borrowed the radio. But just so Christy could hear his kid, he hasn't been talking to any enemy. Oh, is that so? Let me have that thing. Now you hear this, you da-da, goo-goo, tojo, or whoever you are. This is Captain Wallace B. Binghamton speaking, and I'm going to wipe out your entire da-da, goo-goo, spiring. <laughs> What do you say to that, Dada? Da? Oh, she said it! She said it! She said it! <laughs> oh, honey, you said it! She said, oh, darling, she means you! You made her say it! That's me she's talking about! I'm Daddy! 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 Stop that! You men are all under arrest for treason! Guards, guards! Oh, now, Captain, it certainly isn't treason for a father to want to hear his baby talk, is it? Oh, you were wonderful, Captain Binghamton. How will I ever be able to thank you? You mean that's really Mrs. Hoosier? Well, sure. Uh, none of us could get the baby to talk. You were the only one. I was the one who got yeah. the baby to talk? <laughs> How about that? Hey, you want to try to get sir? Yes, I made the baby talk, all right. <laughs> Hello, baby. Dada. Goo goo. Dada. <laughs> sir, sir, even if they're not guilty of treason, you can still throw them in the brig yeah. for stealing and using captured enemy equipment yeah. and also unauthorized use of army wavelengths. Yeah. Yeah. Shut up! What's the matter with you? Aren't you ashamed of yourself sneaking up on these men trying to arrest them and everything? But, sir, these oh, notes the... you told me to take them, I was not. Don't you trust anybody. You throw those notes away. He's a terrible person. Yes, he is. Terrible person. Now, tell me, what is the little doll's name? Oh, well, we're all her godfathers, so, uh, uh, let's see, it would be, uh, Christina, uh, Charlene, Leslie, Wilhelmina, Katinka, Virginia, Hetty, and Quintilla. Oh, yeah. Uh, uh, Wallacina? Wallacina? That's the most ridiculous name for... Uh, ridiculous that we didn't think of it ourselves. <laughs> you know, I always wanted a little girl. Oh, <laughs> well, how, how about it, Christy? Uh, uh, you okay with you? Okay, Skip, Wallacina. <laughs> <laughs> Wallacina. Wallacina. Hello there, little Wallacina. Uh, Dada, goo goo. Dada. <laughs> Dada. Dada. Yeah! Right, dear, whatever you say. Okay, it's been real nice talking to you. I'll write to you tomorrow. Talk to your wife long enough. Let me talk to the baby. Look at Captain. Uh, I'm uh, Captain, I'm awful sorry, but it's getting late. We have to sign off. It's the yeah, baby's well, bedtime. Say bye bye. Give me Look, the Captain, it's it's wait a minute. Wait a minute. That's all. He's the problem. It's my bad Oh, baby. Bye -bye. That's a Daddy Binghamton, baby. <laughs> Say bye-bye. Say bye-bye, honey. That's an order. Wait a minute, Captain. Maybe you need more juice. Bye-bye. Uh, uh, Dada. Bye-bye. Chuck, no! Oh, yeah, yeah. 
Carpenter? Yes, sir. You will draw one Thompson submachine gun and 10,000 rounds of ammunition. You will then station yourself outside of the radio shack, and if Commander McHale or any of his merry men so much as cast a shadow in your direction, you will shoot to kill. <laughs> aye, aye, sir. But, Captain, if you heard what we really want, I I'm sure you'd give us a break. Break? You want a break, Mikhail? Oh, I'll give you a break, all right. Uh, don't shoot the kill. Shoot them in the foot. <laughs> out, out, out. Well, maybe you'd understand if you had a baby of your own. If I had a bit, Him between the eyes. Right between the eyes. Bye-bye, Captain. I'm not going to hear. I'm not going to hear my little baby say, Daddy. Come on, take it easy, kid. Oh, you're full of crummy deals. And we said Binghamton was human. We're going to yeah. take this lying down, Skip. No, you can bet your royal skibbies we're not going to take it laying down. Now, I know that Pete, the radio man, will go along with us. But we got to figure out some way of getting Carpenter away from that radio shack. I know, Skip, but how are we going to do it? Hey, wait a minute, wait a minute, guys. I got an idea. What if we can get that new blonde nurse at the base to take Carpy out for a little moonlight stroll? Nah, he's too G.I. <laughs> that chicken Charlie wouldn't leave his post for a dame. Yeah, but wait a minute. What if the dame uh, turned out to be a damsel in distress? Hmm? Hmm? A damsel in distress. Yeah. <laughs> hey, hurry up, you guys. It's ten minutes of five. How does he look? Fine. You look great. Come on. You heard you all set? Yes. Here we go. Here we go. Stay down. Stay down. <laughs> on duty never leaves his post. Help! I may be an officer, but I'm still a gentleman. Stop! You hear me, sailor? Stop! Oh, I see. I've got it all warmed up for you. I'm going out for a smoke. Good, good. Look, I don't know from not going. Go on, go on, baby. Hey, it's five on the button. Hurry up. This is W9643, San Diego, calling CO Taratupa. This is Victory Easy 397 Taratupa to W9643. Oh, Please, darling, your, your daddy's waiting. Say, Daddy. Daddy? Daddy. Please, honey, please. Papa. Come on, say daddy. Talk to daddy. Daddy, come on, honey. Come daddy. on. Daddy. Can't you get through? Oh, that's the nips for sure, jamming the whole dial. I can't get nothing. But I got to hear my kid. Well, keep working on it, will you? And hurry, Copper will be coming back. I want you to stop! Stop, you fiend! Stop, you fiend! Stop! Oh. Oh. Sir, I'm sorry. Are you all right, sir? Never mind me. I don't know what that sailor sees in that woman, but go after him. Yes, sir, I'm going. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Why aren't you at your post? Oh, sir, that poor little nurse. You should have seen that oh, sailor. She was screaming. Watch your language. That, that poor little nurse. <gasps> I thought that poor little nurse looked like she needed a shave. <laughs> Look out, sir! Oh, honey, this is your daddy. Say, daddy, come on! Right now, I'll settle for a goo-goo. Yeah, you have me a loaded gun. Follow me. Come on, boys, we gotta show off. Come on, let's go. But I gotta hear my kid. Come on, let's go. We better split up and meet over at the... 
At the brig. Is that the word you're looking for? Colin! Oh. I said in, not out. Oh, oh. <laughs> All right, Nurse Bell, you and your boyfriend, go, go! <laughs> Trespassing on government property, operating a military radio illegally, disobeying the commanding officer's orders, luring an officer of the guard from his post, and finally, impersonating a nurse in a combat zone. This is going to be a fun court-martial. Yes, sir, you can't take it out on the whole crew. They did it just to help me, sir. Is that what they did? Get yes, back sir. in line. Ah, uh, well, now, Captain, as commander of the 73, sir, I insist on taking full blame and responsibility. Blame and responsibility, Mikhail? How about guilt? We don't like to break up a set, you know. <laughs> now then. Oh, sir, the phone is ringing. I know the phone is ringing. I've got ears, you nitwit. I'm not taking any calls. <laughs> sir, it's the scramble phone from Comfleet. Killed, Zoe. <laughs> Binghamton here. I, I'm sure that... Uh, Mikhail, I don't know what racket you and your seagoing mafia are mixed up in this time, but whatever it is, this is my answer. Carpenter, sir, you will draw one Thompson submachine gun and 10,000 rounds of ammunition. You will then station yourself outside of the radio shack, and if Commander McHale or any of his merry men so much as cast a shadow in your direction, you will shoot to kill. Aye, aye, sir. But, Captain, if you heard what we really want, I'm sure you'd give us a break. Break? You want a break, Mikhail? Oh, I'll give you a break, all right. Uh, don't shoot the kill. Shoot them in the foot. <laughs> out, out, out. Well, maybe you'd understand if you had a baby of your own. If I had a bit, Him between the eyes. Right between the eyes. Bye-bye, Captain. I'm not going to hear. I'm not going to hear my little baby say, Daddy. Come on, take it easy, kid. Oh, you're full of crummy deals. And we said Binghamton was human. We're going to yeah. take this lying down, Skip? No, you can bet your royal skibbies we're not going to take it laying down. Now, I know that Pete, the radio man, will go along with us. But we got to figure out some way of getting Carpenter away from that radio shack. I know, Skip, but how are we going to do it? Hey, wait a minute, wait a minute, guys. I got an idea. What if we can get that new blonde nurse at the base to take Carpy out for a little moonlight stroll? Yeah. Nah, he's too G.I. <laughs> that chicken Charlie wouldn't leave his post for a dame. Yeah, but wait a minute. What if the dame uh, turned out to be a damsel in distress? Hmm? Mm hmm? A damsel in distress. Yeah. <laughs> hey, hurry up, you guys. It's ten minutes of five. How does it look? Fine. Right. You look great. Come on. You heard you all set? Yes, Here we go. Here we go. Stay down. Stay down. <laughs> on duty never leaves his post. Help! 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 I may be an officer, but I'm still a gentleman. <laughs> stop! Did you hear me, sailor? Stop! Oh, I see. I've got it all warmed up for you. I'm going out for a smoke. Good, good. Look, I don't know from not going. Go on, go on, man. Hey, it's five on the button. Hurry up. This is W. Chuck, you found the nips. Come on, boys, let's go. Hey, the nips took off. Hey, let's go get him, Skip. Hold it, hold it, boys, hold it. Ah, it's too late. Let him go. We got what we came for anyway. Hey, this. Oh. Hey, how about that? <laughs> Ensign Parker just took himself an island. Yeah. <laughs> now I'm going to get me a nip jamming station. Okay, everybody back. All right, hold it, hold it, Chuck. Hold it, hold it, will you, Chuck? Hold it, stop it with those grenades, huh? Well, we got orders to blow it up, and after all, what they did to Christie. I know, I know, but... Say, now. I just got a hot flash here. Willie. We could reach stateside with a shortwave set this powerful, couldn't we? Uh, easy with a couple of changes. Well, uh, what if, say, um, 
At five o'clock tonight, our Senor Christie hears his little girl say, Daddy, courtesy of the Nips. Hey, could I skip? Nah, Binghamton will never give us permission. Yeah. Well, who says we're going to ask for it? Come on, let's go. Come on, let's go. <laughs> Hey, Chuck, what are you looking for now? Oh, I lost a pin. Again? Get here, let me have that. Wait a minute, Skip. Get over here. Jack. I'm trying to tell you, not that pin. No button. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Hey, somebody's coming. Well, how'd it go, Skip? Fine, fine. Boat stash? Yeah, yeah. As far as anybody else knows, we're not back yet. Hurry it up, Willie. It's 28 minutes of five. I'm trying, but I still have to figure out how to make it quit sending that jamming signal. What's so tough about that? Every cotton pick and parts labeled in Japanese. Now, don't let that get you down, boy. Fuji and I will translate as we go along. All right, what do we got here now? Let's see here. Um. Shuhasu Hashinki. That's the RF one. Uh, output. RF output. Hmm, that could be it. I, I give her a. Ooh, turn it off. There's that blasted jamming signal again. Here, let's try this one. Zofuku Kairo. Zofuku. Nah. Um. Hashinka? Hashinka. Try the Hashinka. What? Oh, uh, the oscillator. Oscillator. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I won't rest till I find out why McHale and his men were so anxious to break into that radio shack. Oh, neither will I, sir. It was absolutely disgraceful resorting to such trickery against a fellow officer in the United States oh, Navy, shut sir. Up. <laughs> sir, the scramble phone is ringing. No, the scramble phone is ringing. The scramble phone is ringing. Here, you, you beast! Put me down this instant! Oh, you're so terrible! You put me down! Hold! Sailor! Put that nurse down! Now that's an order! Help! Save me! Somebody save me! Oh, An officer on duty never leaves his post. Help! Help! I may be an officer, but I'm still a gentleman. <laughs> stop! You hear me, Sailor? Stop! Oh, I see. Up for you. I'm going out for a smoke. Good, good. Look, I don't know from not going. Go on, go on, baby. Hey, it's five on the button. Hurry up. This is W9643, San Diego, calling CO Taratupa. This is Victory Easy 397 Taratupa to W9643. We're reading you and standing by. Hello, Taratupa. I've got a Mrs. Christopher and a little Miss Christopher waiting to talk to Daddy. Hello, dear. Hello. How are you, darling? Are you well? Oh, hi, honey. Yeah, I'm, I'm fine. I hope you're well, too. But listen, we haven't got much time. Could you put the baby right on? Of course, darling. That was your daddy, dear. Say, daddy. Talk to daddy, honey. Sweetheart, talk to daddy. Yeah, honey, daddy's waiting. Say it. Daddy. <laughs> D-A-D-D-Y. Come on, darling. Talk to Daddy. Come on, honey. Say Daddy. Come on, honey. Daddy. Dada. Come on, honey. Oh, hey, no more. Keep going. Hey, hey. Please, darling. Your, your daddy's waiting. Say Daddy. Daddy? Hey, no more. Daddy. Please, honey, please. Papa. Come on, say daddy. Talk to daddy. Daddy, come on, honey. Come daddy. on. Daddy. Can't you get through? No, that's the nips for sure, jamming the whole dial. I can't get nothing. But I gotta hear my kid. Well, keep working on it, will you? And hurry, Copper will be coming back. Why are you to stop? Stop, you fiend! Stop, you fiend! Stop! Oh, sir, I'm sorry. Are you all right, sir? Oh, 
Never mind me. Oh. I don't know what that sailor sees in that woman, but go after her. Radio man will go along with us. But we got to figure out some way of getting Carpenter away from that radio shack. I know. Skip, but how are we going to do it? Hey, wait a minute, wait a minute, guys. I got an idea. What if we can get that new blonde nurse at the base to take Carpy out for a little moonlight stroll? Yeah. Nah, he's too G.I. <laughs> that chicken Charlie wouldn't leave his post for a dame. Yeah, but wait a minute. What if the dame uh, turned out to be a damsel in distress? Hmm? Mm -hmm. A damsel in distress. Yeah. <laughs> hey, hurry up, you guys. It's ten minutes of five. How does he look? Fine. You look great. Come on. Are you all set? Yes, here we go, here we go. Stay down, stay down. Now, now. Oh, you, oh, how dare you, you beast! Put me down this instant! Oh, you're so terrible! You put me down! Halt! Sailor, put that nurse down. Now that's an order. Help! Save me! Somebody save me! Oh, you please! Officer on duty never leaves his post. Help! I may be an officer, but I'm still a gentleman. Stop! You hear me, sailor? Stop! Oh, I see. I've got it all warmed up for you. I'm going out for a smoke. Good, good. Look, I don't know from not going. Go on, go on, baby. Hey, it's five on the button. Hurry up. This is W9643, San Diego, calling CO Taratupa. This is Victory Easy 397 Taratupa to W9643. We're reading you and standing by. Hello, Taratupa. I've got a Mrs. Christopher and a little Miss Christopher waiting to talk to Daddy. Hello, dear. Hello. How are you, darling? Are you well? Oh, hi, honey. Yeah, I'm, I'm fine. I hope you're well, too. But listen, we haven't got much time. Could you put the baby right on? Of course, darling. That was your daddy, dear. Say, daddy. Talk to daddy, honey. Sweetheart, talk to daddy. Yeah, honey, daddy's waiting. Say it. Daddy. <laughs> D-A-D-D-Y. Come on, darling. Talk to Daddy. Come on, honey. Say Daddy. Come on, honey. Daddy. Dada. Papa. Come on, honey. 